Yo, I'm Carol 34 and I'm still the most erotic Carol man on the internet and welcome to another highlight session video. Today, a little more challenging for me probably because um, as you may know, usually I play with Joy-Cons in the holder that's there for them, but I've got a new pro controller that I'm gonna use for the first time now. Uh, but yeah, he's a Bowser Jr. man, I believe, if he didn't switch. So we've got an actual difficult matchup now. Like, Link isn't the best matchup either, but the thing is, with how he played it, it became quite a bit easier because the scariest part of K. Ru Link is a bomb edge guards. Which he pretty much didn't do at all. He went off too far there. Oh, I should have gotten the stock there. That should have been the game. But the game still ends. Because he was swinging too early. I'm in Lucario forward air. He did not roll in sadly. Good Bowser man. It's... Painful. I got the weak nair to the stock. I had hoped to get out the shot before the boomerang came back. The links today have bad down air habits. And don't want to bomb recover. I take it back, Guy Bomb recovered. I wanted to be sad because... Oh, what the fuck, how did he die? I wanted to get a stupid up B. I wanted to drop forward air, which may have worked. I wanted to read a neutral tag, sadly. He got pushed off of the platform. And what the hell was that? I was ready to catch a bomb recovery. He didn't manage to go. Oh, if my dash attack got out, he was already it would already be in a very bad spot. Luckily I hit him because um he was at the funny percent. And still I don't manage to Oh I read that jump badly. And that was a very bad jump by him that costs a stock. So often. Okay, he didn't do the stupid play. Um, he did a very stupid play. A zero to death with the most basic K real combo because he just recovered bad. What was the plan? All. God, free falls are so, so bad. Kazuya is probably, like I said it before, 
it really depends on how he's playing. Fast, simple percent. I am probably not dead because I died and he didn't follow. Obviously, I'm dead. Uh, no, I'm not because he's S, but so am I. Very good damage for me. But playing stupidly for a moment there. This is still doable. That counter was a misinput. I nearly messed up, but I still got it. Getting him in a pretty good advantage state on that last stock until he was at like 90. Yeah, uh, the probability of me making this comeback just got quite a bit higher. Ah, if I got something off of that, that would have been important. We take those! Let's go! I actually got the comeback. Uh, I wanted to drop through Nair, which would have hit and extended the combo. But I will take that damage. For a moment I thought I had killed him with the grab trade hitbox. And he missed the tag again. I was ready for it. Nice! that badly. The try to hit three back airs in a row because the first two decided to not spike. Well, but suddenly I'm up by a lot. Okay, that's the kill. No, it isn't because his punish was uh, jab one. Sadly, I believe to remember this guy. Is that the guy I played in my um, trying to kill with every Kale rule move twice who annoyed me a lot? Well, this time I don't have to kill with stupid stuff. And, um... That's the first stock. Air up air. Which doesn't mean they are good for his belly armor. Alright. Got the catch there. He's the cliche K rule. Once it comes to ledge trapping. Sadly missing there. And getting the down air. All right. Here. That's how it could look. And yeah, that was how it does look. Here, that's how these games can work out for me. 
if I just play focused enough. I will go for one or two more of this guys in and then end the session. We are already nearly at one and a half hours. Two percent down that were not in any way necessary or deserved. Oh my god, that's so intense. Well played, I still managed to definitely adapt a lot of really really unnecessary mistakes, but in the end multiple comebacks in a row. Two quite a nice finish. Very intense games for sure. Just the ledge trapping is really stereotypical and doesn't use all the options Carol has. Especially returning crowns that can hit the ledge um, and just cover a lot of space. I'm missing neutral air, forward air, back air, all the aerials. It's really just always the same. Which is also why after I started adapting it didn't really work that much anymore, so if you end up watching this, the guy who I just played, maybe look at that a little. And with that we are done for today's session. If you enjoyed it, leave a like and or subscribe to the channel. If you know someone who might enjoy this, share this video with them and ring the bell.